comes up with the actual challenges. Like they're they so have, creative. There's producers amongst producers. One of these challenges has fidget spinners in it. I know. And I, I'm I like, saw that. And I was like, wait a second. How did you come up giant with fidget. giant fidget spinners that you have to spin around on and throw at a target? I mean, the genius. I mean, fidget spinners are in. The most stupidest thing in the world is the most in thing right now. It's. I, f I feel like there's probably just like an ad lib book that the producers go through with these different oversized. What's good super in pop tiny. culture and how can we use it in a challenge? <laughs> it's exactly right. There's no training for this. This is the most ultimate sport that you have. Like we have so many different stars from all walks of entertainment. We have musicians. We have we have uh, athletes. We have mm -hmm. comedians, and they always say, I, "I'll tell you." I have so many friends that say. I could beat you at a challenge. I can beat you in the challenge. I can, oh, yeah. Well, now we're giving the stars the chance to step up to the plate and put your money where your mouth is and go up against the, our top dogs like CT and Bananas and Wes and Emily and Ashley. I mean, they have opportunities to go up against this. I mean, you might be the best in your particular sport, like mm -hmm. the NFL. We have Terrell Owens, who's one of the best wide receivers. We have an Olympic gold medalist in Sean Johnson. Yeah. We have an MMA fighter in Michelle Watterson. They might be good at those particular sports, but welcome to the challenge because you never know what's gonna happen on these things.